And Penrose Transit is making it easier for more people to get to the polls on Election Day. HRT will offer free rides to voters on November 3rd. Connor Reel has details. There are many people who actually would rather stay home because they don't have a mode of transportation. And if you don't have a means to get there, that translates into a no vote. Dr. Soji Akumalafe is the chair of the political science department at Norfolk State University. He says a lot more goes into voting than the basic right. Voting should be a right, but what is the point when you're not given the means to do that? Which is why today he commends Hampton Roads Transit. What we're attempting to do is make it just a little bit easier for those people who might have a hard time getting to the polling station that they're, that they're assigned to. Making it a little easier by not collecting fares on Election Day, November 3rd. Voter suppression seems to be the order of the day. This is really, really a breath of fresh air. Dr. Okomalafe points to traditionally disenfranchised voters as the primary benefactor. Voter suppression is something that affects, you know, the communities of color and African Americans disproportionately more than any other group. Now the only thing left to do, ensure this becomes a new tradition. But I hope this is not going to be a one-time thing. I hope that they institutionalize this practice. Rain or shine, car or bus, Hampton Roads has one less reason not to vote. In Norfolk, I'm Connor Real, 13 News Now.